Hey Abu Sai, it's the Khalifa. So today I would like to show you how to do your course uh, registration. So if you're a new student and you don't really know uh, how to uh, do this course registration, this very video is going to be helpful for you. So first and foremost, go to your Play Store or you could go straight to your web browser. But I would like to give you this application for it to be easier for you. Without wasting any time, let's get straight in. So, so go to the play store and then you search for this abu application known as um abu zaria just search for abu zaria in google play store once you get this application you can see it has 10 000 downloads with 4.6 ratings so make sure to install this application so if your own is at this stage you can then update it guys it's currently updating so the link to this app will be provided in the description of this video so you can go there to download the app or you can go straight to the play store so this way it will make it easier for you to be able to access the portal at any time but otherwise you can try the web browser like your chrome browser you can try it and it will still work like that but for it to be handy for you i would like to like use this application so you can see how the interface of the application looks so student registration portal staff uh, portal as well you can save your results and orders in form of pdf other documents like your course form and the likes so once the update is complete then i'll take you straight to the app so the reason i updated this very application is that you know, you know updating it will make all these bugs to be fixed and then you can use the application very uh, easily so on this application it offers you so many stuff like you can also save pages that require printing like transaction id result course form etc in form of pdf so this application is installed let's click on open so the link to it will be provided in the description so first and foremost a page like this will load up and then you can see staff and here's the home page here's for the students so as a student i'll click on this student then you have to go to the portal abu student portal so you click on abu student portal and then a page will load up so you have to wait as you can see guys so welcome to abu student registration portal so if you're a new student you know you must already gotten your uh your range number then you can log in here your matric number is the red number so for me i would like to input my red number which is u18 gs 10.7 and then i'll input my password so keep your password safe i've input my password so let's click on login automatically this page loads up so uh this is actually how it looks but sometimes due to some uh, um, internet connection, you can see that some pages are not loading. So you can see the exam card here for you to print out your exam card, your exam results and evaluation and the rest. So here is course registration. This side is course registration. So if you go to your Google Play Store, I mean Google uh, Chrome browser, and you, you take the normal uh, desktop site, it will show you this very stuff. So this, this, this thing this thing that is not showing here is course registration. So click on course registration to reset for your courses. Once it loads up, you can see. So you can do your add and drop here. And as you can see here, guys, the active ones is here. Here is the history. So if you click on this section, they are going to show you the course form, the course you have already registered. And then um, if you click on this section, you can see that this one is 2019 for my first uh, semester. For the second semester, 2019, 2020 here. So I'll click on this, 2019, 2020 for this time around. And the page will still load up. There, as you can see, select semester to view courses. So we are currently in the second semester, so I'll click on second semester to view the courses that are available for me to be able to add and as well drop. So you scroll down and you find the list of courses. You can see biology and the likes of other courses here. So let me try to explain this interface for you. So this biology 112 is a 100 level course. So here is the unit, the status here, and then the information about the course, the lecture uh, group, the lab group. And here is where you can take it. You can take it here. Once you take it here, it's going to be among the courses you are going to be offering. So just go down. So for now, here are the courses I'm offering, like the one that is being taken here. You can see the one down here from this side to this edge. I've already taken all these courses. Those are my geography courses I'm doing. So what you have to do next is for you to uh, view more uh, course courses. So go up, then click on show more courses. Show more courses. Then click on that. It will load up. Then what you have to do is simply to select the faculty from where you want to select you want to get that course from so for example i want to add a biology course so i'll select uh i'll go to life sciences faculty of life sciences so on this section you can see the life science section here click on life sciences then you, you click on the department section to select the department from the biological sciences 
then you have to click on the level click on level here to select the level you want so i'm currently in 200 level so i click on 200 level so if you're 100 level you select 100 level and the likes so a list of courses is going to be here in the drop down menu so click on this arrow you can see select once you click on it then you find the courses that you can offer at that level so the, the course i want to offer now i want to add to one to my courses is um the biology 216 which is hydrobiology so i click on it and then i will click on show in list so as for this course to be added to my course list so show in list and then if you scroll down the other time uh bi biology 216 was not here you know it's not tick at the moment you can see some others are tick because this one these are the one i'm, I'm currently offering so i would like to select this biology uh hydrobiology so i'll click on the group here the drop down menu is none so click on the other section there you click on one that is group one here this section that is lab group then you have to zoom in then click on this mark icon to tick it so another menu have pop up you can see they say type in the course code in caps and click add caps means you have to type it in capital letter so the course code is biology 216 which is by by make sure the, the whole thing is capital letter bio 216 then you click on add to courses and as you can see guys this biology course is added by 216 you can see how the tick has been verified so what you have to do is for you to print if you want to print the course form you can print it from here if you want to view your timetable you can view it from here as well so if you go down to this menu you can see the course the courses i'm offering here is the course code Ge uh, geology 218 geography 214 and the likes so here is biology 216 which was not here before it's now be added so the total unit i've now increased from 16 to 18 and then the maximum credit unit that is reasonable is 24. once you are done with this it has automatically be saved in your in your courses so you can go back so go back by clicking on this uh, um, navigation here go back so if you go to your history here in 2019 and 2020 academic section you can see active and history so here is where you can edit and add and drop uh, courses you want and don't and those you don't want so here this section is for you to view your normal course form so i click on 2019 2020 and here is my course form so on the level i'm 200 level geography and then if you go here's my first semester course form and let's scroll down my second semester course form you can see hydrobiology is here which is biology 216 this is how i added i added the course so you can follow this this step to also add your courses so here is how it is so whatever i want to print it is going to come out in, in, in home so guys if you really enjoyed this video i'm takari for geography students 200 level students so you can uh, like this video and also subscribe to this channel thanks for watching the link to this i'll provide in the description share this video with your friends Hope to see you around.